Hey guys, we are back with some more Trap Master. So, um, from the last video, there has been an update. So, first of all, thank you for the developers for reaching out, giving me early access to this, um, um, to this beta update over here. And then, however, this update will be available to you guys to the demo on on the next October Steam Next Fest. So, be sure to check out um this game trap master when and when um during the october steam next fest and be sure to wishlist the game as well as follow the game i'm gonna put the links in the description below so you can check out the game for yourself so the update adds some even more stuff to the game so um i played this game before back when it was really really early so it's pretty cool to check out those videos as well um so you can see the game evolve you can see the game um, change over time as well as l look at all the different updates ah the sound of this it's so squishy and everything but yeah there it's really fun to see the development of a game from the start you can see all the improvements and all these things and there has been a major update ever since like my previous video and you guys get to see it on the next steam next fest so be sure to check out that so first of all as you can see there there is some changes to the first card that you get from the previous one and plus it adds even more traps so if i i don't really remember these being available these basically these two traps i don't remember these two traps so let's try to get super punch by the way i played some of this in the background so i have a slight idea on what is like what new stuff are added as compared to the previous video but anyway let's go for the super punch with hash which has airstrike which means it deals two times damage to aerial enemies or enemies that are not in the air so that is a very interesting way to do it also i think this is not in the Correct me if I'm wrong, but I, if I remember correctly, this thing in the background was not there before. So it's pretty nice to see like some environment here. And as well as, like I know from the previous, there's also like, these hovering things. But for now, I think let's go to this one. Maybe you could go to a random event as well as get to the merchant. At least have a choice here. And here, as you can see, there has been some changes with the UI, if you've noticed. First of all, um, um, there's an enemy wave counter here. If I remember correctly, it was over here last time. There was something over here with all the enemy buffs, etc. So it's pretty nice that the wave counter is over here to at least have some sort of separation to the ui over here anyway um let's go for a super punch over here let's punch some units and then let's have a bouncy thing just to cover that area up and then it's pretty nice to actually have like a more like for me like the ui seems more organized this time anyway let's just start also if i'm not sure if this was in the game Excuse me. I'm not sure if this was in the game last time. However, I'm curious if the hotkeys were there in the game last time. Because there has been hotkeys for everything. Like space bar, the speed up, the combat, um, these things. Also, the redraw card here thing as well. It's also there. Which is pretty interesting. Plus confirming everything. I swear, whoever invented hotkeys, not only in not only in this game, however, in every game whatsoever, or maybe in like software in general, having shortcuts for different keys is just genius. It makes everything so much more convenient. And I'm glad this game I'm not really sure if yeah, I'm just correct me if I'm wrong. If it if, if if it was available in the previous previous update, um, I apologize for not noticing. But well, how uh, I apologize for not noticing. But at least for this round, we get to appreciate. I mean, for this round, for this wave, I mean, we could we could appreciate 
all that. Anyway, let's redraw cards over here. So if you don't know this game, um, I'm going to do a quick recap. It is basically um, a top-down top down Orcs Must Die game wherein you place traps, prevent these guys from reaching your bl the blue exit over here. And the traps could be... Ooh, time spell? Speed becomes two times its current value. That is interesting. Fears double your energy exhaust. Um, let's try this out. I'm not too sure how that would affect us. Anyway, it's a top-down Orcs Must Die game without the hero where... Um, as well as mixed in with our, some roguelike deck builder elements wherein you use cards, place some traps, place them, place the traps over at certain areas depending on what is available and then what do you call this? and then watch your enemies crumble to a pulp anyway um over here is the energy you um, over here is the energy you have the amount of energy increases as the time as as you start the round it passively increases here are your cards over here you have your draw pile you have your discard pile this is the energy cost this is the damage of the card this is the cooldown of the card I the cooldown of the trap there's a description over here and a name on the upper left is the HP it can restart in a campfire but also um, whenever enemies reach your blue zone, or like your blue portals over here, they damage you. This is the gold. You can use them to buy certain things. Here is the enemy waves. Whenever I start the waves, you can see this would slowly fill up. And once this fills up, a new wave of enemies would, um, would appear. Here is the redraw pile. If you click... Um, if you click R or click the statue, it redraws to a new set of cards and it also charges as well. Once you gain the full recharge, you gain a uh, ability to refresh. Anyway, let us grab this wall and then let's see what the time spell does. I'm actually really curious. Okay, don't get that. Oh, so it just speeds everything up. Okay, let's put these two over here. So yeah, if you're familiar with roguelike deck builders as well as any form of um, any form of tower defense games, this might be familiar to you. So if you are enjoying this game, be sure to put um, be sure to wish this this game as well as follow the game because. Um, it has come a long way and if you've seen one of my first videos on this game you could see how drastically different the game has been from the very start anyway let's redraw some cards um, maybe we could do a sucker punch maybe just push them to the wall over here never mind they're already dead three of them managed to get through also I've noticed um, Torn Dimension. Oh, this is new. When a trap displaces an enemy, deal 6 dash to a random enemy of a field. Ooh. At the start of each enemy, we discard one random card and gain one anti gravity. What? Okay. First of all, there's a take all button. I didn't even notice that. Um, first of all, that is cool since we are displacing enemies most of the time, so might as well. Um, let's go here instead. Random event. Welcome, sir. Oh, this is new. As you can see, it used to be like a horizontal screen over here and the text was like over here. Anyway, welcome, sir. Would you like to make a name for yourself? You need to become stronger first. Okay. You heard the shrill. You heard the shrill laugh coming from behind the counter. You're going to... Ooh... I think I'm gonna get a rare trap card. It is trap trap master. Ooh, I remember this guy. Frost marksman. Summon a marksman plus one damage to all summons. Extra boost when summoned on ice. I remember this guy. This I remember using that guy in the previous video. He was there. He was there. What the hell is this? Are these rocks? Oh no! Can I not place? Oh, I cannot place sharp spikes on that area. That is cruel, my guy. 
um anyway um let's do it like this and let us start the game and i think i'm gonna redraw over here to get some better cards we have some super punch we could actually utilize as well as some bouncy pads over here um, we could also do a sucker punch if we have also you can zoom in really close which is really fun anyway there's oh it's foreign dimension already okay let's go for the frost marksman first because I remember this guy being really powerful last time. Oh, um, excuse me. Why are you go going away from the enemy? Go closer to the enemy, you freaking coward. Also, as you can see, the, the buffs for the enemies are already over here. And you have your own buffs over here in the lower left-hand corner over here. So, by the way, since this is... um, What do you call this? So this, since this game is um, also in like relatively early, if you have any comments and suggestions, you can feel free to um, contact, I mean, play the game for yourself, play the demo, join their Discord. So you can air out your ideas, maybe help the developer as well um, with some bugs and all these things. Because this game... I'm really excited on how this game would come out in the final product. It's just really satisfying to see how the game evolves throughout its course. It's kind of like a similar feeling to following like uh, those in like in the past those really when when early access was first ooh, demon bomb. Uh, furious. Okay, let's go for a wall bouncer, maybe. Or maybe we could go for skill. Let's try this. Maybe we can get some early energy at the very start. It's it's kind of satisfying to follow all... Okay, I don't think we need a campfire, but let's just see if there's anything new. Ooh! This new. Look at the art. Wow. Okay, anyway, let's upgrade a card over here. Um... You get increased damage. You get increased damage. Three times the current value. Nine damage on the field. What's the difference here? Oh, it costs zero. I see. Okay, let's upgrade our Frost Marksman because it's our rare cards. Plus, it's golden. And let's go to the merchant. I have no money. And as you've noticed, look at the shop. It is different now it has its own layout you could also it's, it has a much cleaner layout and it then look at this background over here anyway you can also remove cards now someone slingshot that and sends enemies to the start Ooh, okay you know what since this is on a discount it's so tempting flawless snap crisp snap what the hell are these Ghoul's Embrace. Anyway, I think I could afford to get this and have a card removed. Let's try to remove... Let me see here. Let's try to remove a Sharp Wall Spike. And let's go for an Elite. Hopefully you could survive this. Okay, first of all... uh. Okay, this is interesting. Let's go for you like this first. Then let's have a super punch pushing you over here. And you know what? Let's just start. Ooh, these guys. So these guys are new. If these guys are not were not in the previous iteration of the game. So these guys are really interesting they seem like jelly am i right if you kill them well like how do i explain this if you if you destroy them while by by regular means like damaging them they split into how do i say they split into two people 
So it is annoying. It's one of, they have splitter enemies now, which is both annoying as well as adds a variety of to the game. Anyway, excuse me. Let's add a frost marksman over here, hopefully to help defend. Ooh, did you see that guy get shot? Okay, um, let's just save up our money over here. Double our energy. Do this. Maybe put a sucker punch here. Like that. Also, I like the sound design we're in. It slows down every time you... Every time you actually try to place a game. Okay, let's see how this works. Oh, so it's a one-time use. Okay, that is interesting. Also, where the hell is my archer? Did, the, did my archer die or something? Oh, my archer is there. I see, I see. Go, my archers, go! Um, excuse me, that guy was so fast. What the hell? Let's do this. Let's redraw. Um, let's just place you over here. So in case the very fast dudes actually get through, they would, they would most likely get ye yet yeeted back to their own to the start of the game. Also, those are a lot of wins, but this is the final wave. Hopefully, we could push them together. These guys are really heavy. But I hope my gear deception would actually shred them. And just like that, we have one. Select one card. Destroy all wall traps, ground traps, gain six speed. Um, excuse me. Demon flames, you playing for ongoing enemies. It's so tempting. Do we have a lot of ground traps? Yeah, technically we do. But ah, oh, it's so tempting. You know what? Let's just go for a grapple snare. Add inscription. When this trap kills an enemy, there's a chance to summon a meter at the death location. Um, what? Okay, let's do it to our frost marksman. And let's get a treasure. Gain 10 extra gold per battle. Okay, we take those. It's pretty early, so that was a pretty lucky choice. And let's go to the next level, shall we? Ooh, this is an interesting setup. I'm just gonna summon you. And hopefully you get to see the meteor animation. Right, so, so the bounce mesh is not actually going to help us. Oh, did you see that? Um, we need more sharp walls as well as... Ooh! Did you see that? Okay, let's go to a time spell so that these guys would double with their speed. Let's do it like this. Gain, gain that one as well as gain some gear deception over here. Probably like so. Oh, excuse me, why are you here? Um, I think I'm just gonna get Torn Dimension. And then... Let's go for a Grapple Punch, maybe. Just punch them back over here. And we, and we really don't need a Grapple Snare right now. Oh, Frost Marksman. Another Frost Marksman. Double the Meteor. Look at the Meteors. Plus all plus our relic dealing damage ev and ever we displace enemies. Um, let's rotate you. Let's place you here. Place you here, and don't forget gear this. Oh, never mind. We already won. Crystal is oh this is new. Devour enemies plus fifteen dash for each enemy killed permanent. So it's an infinite scaling. Okay, you know what? We take those. 
I didn't even bother to read the other ones. <laughs> they might have been better, but you know what? We take it. My furnace. Double the displacement effect of this trap. After playing plus 3 speed to draw cards cooldown. Whenever this card is on fire, it becomes... Ooh, zero. Okay, we take those. We take it to... The Cursed Abyss, probably. Confirm. And let's go to random event here. The ruins. You step in the rocky ruins. The compass is not working. The sun, the moon, the stars seems to have lost their way. You step into some rocky ruins. The cosmos is not working. You didn't have a plan to come here. How are you going to survive there with no directions and no supplies? Okay, get one goose embrace. 25% chance. Upgrade two random cards. Get three death scars. Ooh. Okay, I'm curious what is ghoul's embrace. Oh, it's in that card. Fair enough. I don't have any money, so I'm not going to look. And campfire, let us upgrade the card. Cursed Abyss. Or oh, it just reduces the cooldown. Ooh. First three upgrades change the trap's form. Oh, let's try that. And let's go to the boss. Okay, everybody, are you ready with your drinks, with your snacks? Hopefully, we could win this. This is a huge map. Um, Let's just place you over here. Let's grab a Frost Marksman. And let us start. And I don't like these ones. Let's get some more interesting cards over here. Um... Let us do it like so. Um, let's also get a punch thing out here. Okay, what? First of all, what the heck are you? You look like a scary person. Anyway, let's just read our cards. Hopefully, we could win this. Um, excuse me. Okay. That was... That was rude. You skipped all of my traps. So, I'm just gonna grapple one of you. Okay, hopefully... Freaking Rich here would... Would die soon. Um, let's redraw over here. I know... I know that we could have destroyed them, but we really need... We really need a way to get more cards here. And maybe some Frost Marksman. A new wave of enemies gonna calm down. Let's grab our new Marksman. Okay, come on, come on. Golden Shield will help you. Um, I don't think so. Let's have a super punch. I mean a sucker punch. Ooh, I destroyed them. He is now back, I think, from the start. Those are a lot of enemies. Could you guys calm down? Um, let's place you over here. Um, spikes over here. And let's get gather enough energy for the torn dimension, hopefully. So at least we could deal more damage to other units. And ooh, finally, Cursed Abyss. Let's place you over here. Hopefully that should be enough to destroy the enemies. We also have a Ghoul's Embrace over here. And some Grapple. Play, place it like that. Ooh. You guys are screwed now. Okay, second round. What the hell are you doing? Okay, another Frost Marksman. Three of these guys should be able to deal with the boss pretty easily. Freaking rich. Please die. Ooh. Is he dead? 
Yes, he is. I think it's the first time we actually defeated this guy. Demon can dark blades. When the enemy falls in the water, someone at tide deal five lane dash to random enemy on the field. What? Pyrepotent can slowed one counts when cards are added are added to the hand. What the hell? I'm so curious here. I this honestly I'm curious with the demon cannon. The trap instantly kills an enemy, but trap cooldown becomes 19 seconds. What? Um oh, oh. when this card is the far left hand, it will be played two times, okay. Can we actually do it with this guy? Ooh. Okay, we also get another treasure. Add the poison to trap attacks, but reduce cap. Gain plus one extra chapter. Oh no. <clears throat> Add burn to trap attacks, but reduce speed by four. Oh. You know, let's go for Gambler's Finger. This would be a really interesting. This this the eye thing. Okay, we're already at chapter two. What are these? Magic mirror? Okay, let's try to reach the magic mirror over here. Um, oh, a treasure. You know what? We take the treasure. I haven't really played this area over here. I usually stop the video at this. But since it's still pretty fun. Oh, Ghost Embrace is cost 4. Okay, first of all, let's go for a sharp wall spike. So, enough floor spike. And might as well gain another floor spike. And let's start. Let's redraw. What the hell are these fish? Ooh, Frost Marksman. Okay, let's grab it like this. Cursed Abyss. Ooh, we have a moving platform. That is interesting. Okay, I'm just gonna wait for Super Punch over here. And then this should be played twice, if I'm not mistaken. So if I do this, and this, now we have two, en two enemies over here. Oh my god, they're so fast. What the hell? Fish. Are these even fish? They look like fish. Anyway, let's redraw the cards. Torn Dimension. Oh, I can't believe that guy didn't actually get through. That was so freaking close. Um, let's have a grapple over here. A demon cannon. I'm really curious on how this one place okay so since I don't have any cannons yet I mean any cannonballs that should be a sign what the hell people got through excuse me okay let's play this one first let's play this guy next play the sharp spike next and play a frost marksman so now we have four frost marksmen And let's redraw the card. Thank you so much. Oh, look at that. Okay, so this, so our build should be focused on redraw, or maybe adding cards. Okay, that is an interesting way to handle it. Okay, let's have bounce mesh over here. Hopefully, you could push them to the limit. Limit. Let's see. Those are a lot of units. Wow, the AOE. Okay, come on, please. Ooh, Titan Bow, that is useful. Okay, we're already at the final wave, so I think we're gonna survive. Okay, this. Oh, yes, finally. Okay. Demon Spike, concentration. Gain two strength, lose two strength after one enemy waves. Ooh. You know what, let's skip this. I don't really want these cards. My cards are fine as it is. So I, I'd rather choose not to. I'm doing the smart play here. 
What the hell? Alright, let's go for this. First. Let's do it like here. And then, Crest Abyss should be... Around this area. Hopefully that would... That would serve as well. Okay, bounce smash. Okay, why are these guys so freaking expensive? <laughs> and let's just do this. And let's redraw cards. These these cards are so expensive. Um first of all, do this. Second of all, um super punch. Second of all, do this. Third of all, do this. And let's try to redraw. Redraw faster! Redraw faster! Okay, let's go for a demon cannon. Let's go for the frost marksman. And since we can play two of these guys, that would be really fun. Um, what? Excuse me. Okay, we have 9 HP. We should be really careful here. Or else we would absolutely be screwed. Oh no, careful, dude. You're gonna get crushed. Um, okay. Um, we could go for another super punch over here. Just have people getting punched in the face. And then let us hopefully get a redraw situation over here. Um, excuse me. How how is that guy still alive? Okay, uh, let's grab that. Let's grab the wall bouncy thing. Let's have another sucker punch thing. And let's have a grapple over here. Um, excuse me, final wave, final wave, be careful. We have demon cannon over here. We could use that. We could also get even more gear deception. Come on, dude. Come on, how are these guys still alive? I'm going to die. Come on, just destroy this guy, please. Please, thank you. Okay, we are so close to death. Inflict ongoing gear damage after after playing discard one card. So after using a skill card, play speed. You want us to go for this? Maybe that would be helpful for us. I need a campfire, man, or else I'm going to die here. Um, Let's go for a treasure. Never mind, it costs freaking HP. I will run away because I will absolutely lose my... All of my HP there. Okay, I hate this map. It's so open. Help me. Okay, let's go for a super punch. Facing that way. Hopefully, we could destroy them. And then, let's go for a time spell. And let's just start the round, shall we? Oh, it's air units. Okay, that is interesting. Uh, with that in mind, let's just do this. Do that, do that, and probably a grapple. I really don't know how to use a grapple here. It's free anyway, so might as well get it right. Like so. And then redraw man. Oh torn dimension. Thank you. Redraw re I will die. Help me, help me, help me. Oh, I'm just dead. <laughs> okay. And just like that, ooh, game over. We got eaten by the book, guys. Anyway, um, which is Trap Master. If you like Trap Master, please add it to your Steam wish that will mean a lot to us. Anyway, so yeah, this is it for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to check out the game. I'm gonna put the links in the description below. And as well as um, be sure to leave a like. It shows me that you enjoyed the game, as well as the developers that you enjoyed the game. Also, if you want subscribe because i upload new videos every day be sure to check them out as well check out my other videos and be sure to leave down a comment helps helps in the algorithm and 
I will see you next time. See ya. Have a great day.